Hey guys, hope you're well. I'm going to Birmingham today and I'm so excited because I'm going to Free Radio Live. I don't know if you know what it is. If you don't, it is basically a music concert with loads of acts on. It's like a radio show, so there's some really cool acts on there. My boys, the Vamps, are performing and I'm so excited to see them because I haven't seen them in a while actually. Demi Lovato, Liam Payne, The Script, who I absolutely love. I've always loved The Script. And there's like a couple of others as well, so I'm very excited. I only found out that I was going the other day. I'm going with my friends Georgie, Soph and her little sister. And I'm just really, really excited because I haven't actually seen them both in so, so long as well, actually. So a catch up is well needed. And fun fact, we actually went to free radio together years ago to see Pixie. And it was the first place I ever saw the vamps. So we're talking four, five years ago maybe? I don't know, I'm awful years. But I'm very, very excited. The only problem is I have to leave the gig early to get home because the last train is at like half ten, which is really early for a Saturday night. So I'm very annoyed about that. But I'm very, very excited for today. And I have a feeling that's going to be very good. Oh wait, guys, I've just got to show you. This come yesterday. It is insane. Taylor Swift's new album, Reputation. Ah. Oh. So good. But my opinion on Reputation, I do really love it. I think it's really, really good. But I just, I don't know if it's my favourite Taylor Swift album. And I hate to compare it, but I feel like Red will always have my heart. I just love Red so, so much. But I'm still listening to it non-stop. Not in the vlogs, because I get copyright probably. But I do really love it, so yeah. Right, enough of me chatting about Taylor Swift when this vlog has nothing to do with Taylor Swift I'm gonna go get ready and eat have some breakfast I don't know what to wear because I'm not taking a bag with me because it's a gig and I've got to come back straight after the gig it's just gonna be so much hassle so yeah I don't know what to even take I'm not gonna take the scarf because that's just annoying you know I like it um, yeah I'm just wearing this jacket and jumper I wore it the other day actually when I saw Becky, but I like it, so I'm, I'm an outfit repeater. I'm gonna get my fair share of wear out of them. Wow, I love that saying. Fair share of wear. Right, anyways, I'm about to go to the train station now. Um, I'm just checking I've got everything, because I'm not taking a bag with me. So, yeah, it's a bit, a bit like, what the hell. <laughs> yeah, let's go, let's go get the train. Hello, so I made it to Birmingham. The Gentle Arena is actually over there. I'm not actually going in for like a couple of hours, but these guys just say hello. Hi. Jay's hiding. Yeah. <laughs> just bumped into the Yossi. Hello. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, <laughs> they're clearing all the duvets in the oh. background. <laughs> <laughs> hello, so I'm now in Birmingham and I'm with Pete. <laughs> this is so weird. It's I haven't seen you both in ages. <laughs> Madness. Right, we're going to go get some food and then go to the gig. What is it? What, that's the place. There you go. That's the place. Best, place ever. best pasta, best pizza, best wine. If you get a loyalty card, you get discounts on the pounds. Yes. <laughs> so I'm torn between the pizza because they sound really good or getting a pasta dish because they sound really good. I just don't know. Yay. Oh my god, that looks amazing. Guys, I'm not going to wait for you. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. Wow. So, I'm boring. I went for a marguerite pizza. But so are these guys, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited to eat. Oh. Right, so it's bloody cold. We've just got out of the Uber. Oh, We're walking to the box office to get our tickets now. And um, yeah, it's freezing. I can't wait to get inside. <laughs> yeah. We're about to go in. Gentle Arena. Yes. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> so we just got to our seats and just look at this view. This is just sick. The stage is uh, I mean, there's the standing bit. And the whole arena goes around like that. This is a banger of a tune. This used to be like my favorite song back in the day. So I just tweeted a picture and um, this is the picture. Oh my god, that's not the picture. This is the picture, okay? <laughs> I tweeted it to go out there and I'm hoping it does sometime soon. And if it doesn't, then that's very awkward.
So I just had to run out of the goo. I didn't get to see the farms. I'm a bit sad, but my last train is literally in about five minutes. Oh my God. I don't know what this footage is even like, but this is me running to catch my train at half 10 because the last train, which makes me so annoyed because I can't even get anywhere near to my house. This is like the last train to get anywhere near my house. Literally. Oh, oh my god. But yeah, I'm so, so sad that I didn't get to see the band. I'm really annoyed. I thought they would have been on earlier. I didn't get to see the pain as well, which is upsetting. I've got work at nine o'clock and I'm literally just... Oh my god. God, guys, the gig was fun from what I experienced it. I'm not even in focus. What the hell? Oh my God, it's freezing. Right, um, oh my God, I've got 20 minutes. I've just left the gig early and legged it down here. And I literally could have done it, but at least I'm definitely gonna get the show and definitely gonna get home because I don't want to be stranded in Birmingham. Oh man, I need some water. <laughs> oh my God. The gig was fun, so fun. The script. Oh my god, the script. I've always wanted to see them live and uh, they were just incredible. They're one of those bands that I've just loved always. Like, from as long as I literally can remember, I always used to get their albums at Christmas time and I've always wanted to see them live. And yeah, I finally did and oh, that was just amazing. Right, so, Sop is open. So I managed to get myself a cheeky little sub. I've literally got 15 minutes to spare for my train, but I'm happy that I got here at this time. Otherwise I probably wouldn't have made this train. And I've got a subway and I'm starving, so that's always good. Yeah, just waiting for the train now, which is gonna take me about three hours to get home. Yay. Oh my God, so I'm just editing the vlog now and I didn't actually end it. There is actually footage of me getting in and I definitely did end it. Oh. At like two in the morning, I was so tired, but I definitely remember ending it. But I don't think I pressed the record button, but I'm just refilming and ending. So Free Ready Live was great. It was such a good gig. I'm kind of gutted that I missed the vamps because I do love seeing them and I do love them so much. So I'm very gutted about that. But my favourite acts of the night were Demi Lovato and The Script. They were just incredible, so, so good. Huge thank you to my friend Georgie for hooking me up with the tickets because that was very, very appreciated. I had the best time and it was very, very fun. And yeah, if you like this vlog, give it a big thumbs up. I hope you did. I don't really know what it was. It, it seemed like a bit of a mess, but um, yeah, I had lots of fun and yeah, I'll see you all very soon. Bye.